FaceTime is a popular video and audio calling app that is exclusively available for Apple devices. While FaceTime is generally known for its high quality video and audio, users may sometimes experience poor quality during their calls. So in this video, we will address the problem wherein the video and audio quality of FaceTime are very low on iPhone. But before moving on, please take a moment to like and share our video. This will help us reach more people who may be facing issues with their device. All right, now let's continue. Here's what you can do. First solution, restart your iPhone. Restarting your iPhone is important because it can help resolve various software issues that may be affecting its performance. It can also free up memory and clear out any temporary files that may be causing problems. To restart your iPhone, press and hold the power button and either of the volume keys until the slide to power off slider appears. Slide the slider to turn off your iPhone, wait a few seconds, and then press and hold the power button again until the Apple logo appears. Your iPhone will then restart. After that, try to see if the FaceTime quality has improved. If not, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, check your internet connection. Checking your internet connection is important because it ensures that you have a strong and stable connection, which is essential for many online activities, including streaming, video calls, and browsing. It can also help identify issues with your network and troubleshoot any connectivity problems. To check your internet connection on an iPhone, follow these steps. Open the Settings app. Tap Wi-Fi or Cellular, depending on how you connect to the internet. Make sure the Wi-Fi or Cellular switch is turned on and that you're connected to a network. If you're connected to Wi-Fi, check the signal strength to ensure that you have a strong and stable connection. If you're using cellular data, make sure that you have a strong signal and that your data plan is active and has enough data. If you have a good internet connection and the problem continues, move on to the next solution. Third solution, check the camera and microphone. Checking the camera and microphone on your iPhone is important because they are essential components of FaceTime calls and any issues with them can affect the quality of your calls. It's important to ensure they are not covered, blocked or dirty to ensure optimal performance during calls. To check the camera and microphone on your iPhone, follow these steps. Open the camera app on your iPhone and switch between the front and back cameras to ensure they are working properly. Record a short video with sound using the camera app and play it back to check the audio quality. Open the voice memos app and record a short audio clip to check the microphone quality. During a FaceTime call, tap the flip camera icon to switch between the front and back cameras and ask the other person if they can hear and see you clearly. If you notice any issues with the camera or microphone, try cleaning them with a soft dry cloth or compressed air. If the issue persists, you may need to contact Apple support or make an appointment at an Apple store for further assistance. Fourth solution, reset your network settings. Resetting your network settings can resolve connectivity issues on your iPhone by resetting all Wi-Fi, cellular and VPN settings to their default state. It can also fix issues with slow internet speeds, network-related errors, and other problems related to your iPhone's connectivity. To reset network settings on your iPhone, just launch settings and tap General. Scroll down and tap Transfer or Reset iPhone. Tap Reset to reveal the options and then select Reset Network Settings. Enter your security lock and then proceed with the settings reset. In most cases, these steps can fix issues like this because it all boils down to how stable your connection is. We hope that we've been able to help you. Thanks for watching.